Okay, it is the morning. We got here late last night. The first thing we're doing this morning is trying to put our WeBoost antenna in a tree. So we plan to shoot the WeBoost up into this crevice and <laughs> see if we can get the antenna up there. We, once we have good service, then hopefully our internet box will work. We just need to have good cell phone reception. We're using a bow and arrow to shoot it through the tree. Fall is coming. heaviness definitely helped. So our plan is we shot over a fishing line with a bow and arrow over <laughs> a tree branch and then we plan to attach a rope to that fishing line and bring it back over the branch. We're putting together our Wii Boost so it comes with the modem. This is a little indoor antenna and then this is the outdoor antenna and it comes with two 30 foot cables there's one and there's one and all the brackets to mount it outside okay so we've had ourselves quite a day it's like six o'clock now or so and this morning so when we left last time i set mouse traps but none of them went off and all the food was eaten so then we got like rat poison which I was hesitant against but my mom bought it so i set them out all over the cabin before we left came back i forgot about them this morning we were outside and my dog is flinging rat poison in the air like it's a toy. So, my dogs ate rat poison. We had to run to the vet as quickly as we could and it was really, really scary. And we had to make them throw up. Tip, if your dog ever eats rat poison, feed them peroxide, it will make them throw up, which is wonderful. We went to the vet and they kept them at the vet for a couple hours to make sure they were okay. And they seem to be doing fine. We just need to watch them. For 24 hours so felt like a terrible dog mom this morning <laughs> and then while we were gone my dad we kept working on the internet we got the rope over the tree in the last um bow and arrow shot and it worked and so i'll show you guys where we're at now okay, we're coming off of it we'll do it at a shorter location we'll do it so here we have <laughs> our <laughs> What is it? PVC pipe? No. Huh? A pole. How tall is it? 60 feet? Our 60 foot pole. I looked everywhere on Facebook Marketplace for a CB tower so that we could just, you know, be normal. But we have ours in a tree. And so the pole is so that we can turn it in the correct direction. <laughs>
Okay, so yesterday we got the internet antenna booster up there and it was working really well, which is great. And then we bought um, that Nomad internet, but then I got an email on the way down saying that none of their Sims car SIM cards worked and that they got new ones and they'll be sending them out. So that didn't work at all. It didn't work when we had full service on the highway, so it's not gonna work here. <laughs> so we have to wait again for the internet, but we will see, hopefully that works because that at this point is our best bet, but we have good service. So we have our phone internet, which is great. We decided to just paint this room floor for now. It'll be the mud room since we ran out of flooring. getting the fridge. We ditched the boys while they were doing drywall. Hey, monster. It looks so good. Oh my God, it's a whole room. when things go wrong. So we just put this fireplace together with the stack and everything and started a fire. And then we look inside. And there is a can of paint stuck inside here. And we have to move this all back and we just took forever to jam this thing in. We have to take it off. So that's fine. But I got to mow the driveway down. So I mowed all of this. You can see the difference. Mowed lawn. 
I love mowing the lawn, so I was so excited to get our lawnmower running, cut some grass. She made it. She made it up the hill. Okay, it's Monday and we're heading home. Yesterday we got so much accomplished. We got the back room completely drywall and mudded except for the places where the electric and the water are going. We've got the middle wall built. Our Wi-Fi is running and set up and we got it tied to the tree so you can't see it as much. We got our stove in place, which was something we've been waiting on doing forever. So we got a lot of odds and ends tied up. We don't have the water pumping all the way up the hill, but soon we might have to get a bigger pump, but we have to figure that out. But we're heading home and we're excited to be back soon. We're gonna order solar today. So it says it's gonna take about four weeks. I'm sure we'll be back in the meantime to do smaller stuff like paint and uh, work on the inside. But other than that, we got tons accomplished. Look at this wood stack back here, it's massive. Very exciting.